And that decision on student loans means roughly 44 million Americans and more than 2 million Pennsylvanians will not be able to receive thousands of dollars in student debt relief. Sarah Wilson is here with more on how this could affect borrowers. Sarah. Valerie, this is a story we've been following ever since President Biden announced his plan to eliminate some student debt last August. Now, if the high court had ruled in Biden's favor, $400 billion of debt would have been erased. That is obviously not happening, and that means borrowers will have to start paying again at the end of August. For a lot of graduates, that might be difficult. Financial experts we've spoken to this past year say because borrowers haven't made payments since March of 2020 when they were on pause for the pandemic, some graduates could ultimately default on their loans. Now, if you're listening to this going, oh gosh, that's me, studentaid.gov can help. They actually will show you uh, your repayment options. So you can look at um, hopefully lowering payments. Um, obviously remember what your original payment was. It's been a couple of years. And if you're struggling for payments, they even have a spot where you can go and check on uh, how you can, you can reduce hopefully your payments. If that number is still too high, financial experts emphasize that the federal government will work with you to help you repay that debt. We'll talk a lot more about that tonight at five. Valerie.